Well, welcome back to the Fox Shop. Got Buddy Boy down here. Got Jesse. Jesse's right over here. Had a little bit of uh, freezing rain and a little bit of snow this morning. Nothing, nothing really. And then just some rain. Had a few leaks in the ceiling. There's one spot over there. That's that's going to be a problem. Uh, the table over here got a little bit dribbled on it and the same over here on the workbench it was leaking over here a spot right up in there that's bad i think that spot's good that spot's not good i imagine we get a big heavy rain that's not going to be good but one thing that happened today i was taking uh taking my daughter back to her mom and right when we were leaving somebody somebody showed up Mama Kitty, the old mama cat. I haven't seen you in over a week and a half. That's dried blood on her nose. I think she's missing a few teeth. Um, her ears, I'm not sure what's going on. They got kind of blackish looking up around there. I don't know if that's frostbite or blood or what. Can't see her tail, but it kind of looks the same. She's gotten really skinny. She may not look like it sitting there all bunched up, but she's like skin and bones. She was really hungry, so I, I brought her down here. Just gave her some dry cat food, and she, she was eating that. I'm not sure she was chewing it, though. She seems to be missing some teeth. I don't know if they got knocked out or just because she's old or what. And you might be able to tell she's a little skinny in the, in the back end, and she's wanting more food, I guess. But uh, did that, and also... Also gave her a can of tuna, which she she ate most of it. If I brought her back up here, she might finish it off. She's been eating and drinking. I've been trying to keep her in here and get her warmed up. She's going to have to go back outside after a while, but she's back, which makes me happy. She's been around here for a long, long time. This is probably going to be a short video, just about Mama Kitty being back. I'm I'm rather happy about that, and she's she's Buddy's friend. But Abby and uh, Abby and Jill are gone. Cooked up some uh, wings on the old Blackstone the other night. Let's see, was it last night? I think it was two nights ago. Yeah, it was two nights ago. Uh, fried some up on that. Did some on the smoker. I got, I've got to clean this. I'm horrible about cleaning this thing. I always let it go a couple days or two, and then it. That's not a good thing to do, and I may have to resurface this pretty soon. We we're going to put out a whole bunch of videos on the, the Hungry Fox or the Fox Shop Barbecue or you can look up the Hungry Fox Barbecue. I think any of that will pull it up. And uh, you want out, Jeff? No, you don't need to go out because you go out in the field and your paws get all muddy. And we're going to have to get you cleaned up before we go to the house. But uh, why don't you move? Just let, let me go out. No. Anyway, right now, there's Mama's offspring, which that's who I thought it was when, when she first came running up, but I've never been able to pet nor pick that cat up. And so Jill and I were like, that's got to be Mama Kitty. But uh, yeah, it's, it's cooling off. I'm not sure how windy it is out here. Sounds like it's, yeah, it's a little breezy. Had some people comment... Uh, Mr. Tough Ancient Spark, I love your comments, guy. You, you comment a lot. I appreciate it. Um, talking about, you know, getting up on the roof and tarping it or whatever until we can uh, figure out what we're going to do and get it fixed. But I don't think you have any idea how big this thing is. I'm going to step out in the wind. I don't know what you're going to be able to see. And I'm not picking on you. But, let's see if I can cover this up with my hand a little bit. I'm not getting up there. Are you crazy? There's no way I'm getting up there. That, we, I mean, we've got the lean-to here, and my camera is not focusing. we got the lean-to here, and then it goes up even steeper all the way up there. I'm not doing it. 
No way. I would have got up on the, on the lean-to here, maybe in my younger years. Even that I don't like anymore. I had a thing, you know, Bud's getting out. Had a thing, uh, when I built this shop in here, look out, Jess. I don't want you going out. You go out and run in the field. When I built this shop, the only light in here was that, that light bulb right there. And so, and I think that's, I think it's about 15, 16 feet high. And had an extension ladder leaned up against there. I climbed up there. I was going to change that light, so I had a little bit of light in here. Got up there and noticed, uh, yeah, the ladder was barely hanging on to that beam up there. And I said to myself, self, this isn't good. About two seconds later, that ladder let go. And I came crashing down onto the floor here. I laid there for a little bit. That didn't feel real good. Didn't break anything, nothing, nothing major happened with that. But ever since then, I have been, I, I don't like getting up on ladders. I don't like climbing up on the grain bins. I don't like getting up on top of things like that because, well, I kind of found out what can happen when you do that. But, uh, well, the old shop too, I'd, I'd like to get up on top of there and screw down a bunch of that metal. I did that, you know, about 20 years I did that. About half of it, west half, I got up there and screwed it all down. I don't think I'd get up there now. Maybe I can get my son to do it. He'd probably jump up there and do it, no problem. Mama Kitty, are you still hungry? I know, you need to eat. You probably haven't eaten in well, how long? Here, you want some more? I don't like doing this. Because if Buddy, oh, Buddy's not in here. If Buddy eats cat food, let's just say uh, later in the night, doesn't smell so good. But Jesse seems to be okay with it. Leave Mama Kitty alone. Jess, Jess, come on, come on. Let Mama eat. She needs to eat. But anyway, guys, that's what's going on here tonight. As far as the blue truck, I would like to get going on it. I just, uh, I don't know how things down down here in this here shop are going to be as far as leakage. I don't think it's going to be very good. Haven't heard anything back on insurance yet. And have another guy um, supposed to be coming out and doing an estimate, but uh, said he's got a real busy week and a funeral to go to. And so I don't know. We'll we'll play it by ear and see what happens. But anyway, and now Jesse's eating all the cat. Jesse, 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 come on, let Mama Kitty eat. At least you guys get along. Here, here. You can have your own little pile right there. Okay. So anyway, gonna head up to the house here shortly. I just came down. Haven't even fed the outdoor cats. I just want to take care of take care of Mama Kitty, and I might clean this thing off. I don't think you're supposed to let him sit like that. And it's starting to, the surface isn't starting to look real good. So may have to resurface it. That might be a whole nother video. And would like to do a video. I probably will do a video on that channel. On that gauge. And how that works out. But this is going way too long. So I am going to sign off here. Um, probably not. Eh, who knows. But probably not going to have another video out. Unless something comes up before New Year's. So I. Hope you have a great New Year's. Be safe. Don't drink and drive. And uh, we'll, we'll catch you next time, guys. Bye-bye.